Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the May release, which is the build 22621.1635. This is the optional update for the month of April. And of course, in this update, we have a few more features that have been officially added and documented by Microsoft in the May release of Windows 11. In this video, as always, we're gonna talk about what is new, what has changed, and also what is fixed in this latest update for Windows 11 in the May release. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, this update adds animations to a few icons on the widget taskbar button. So as you can see, depending on the weather that is currently previewing the region where you're at, you're going to see that you can encounter some animations in the widgets icon, which I think it looks pretty nice. Of course, right now I have the widgets open or hover turned off. You can also do that or if you turn it on using the settings from the widgets board, of course, when hovering over, you will get Get that animation and also the widgets port will open. Microsoft is also adding a new toggle control on the settings and Windows update page. When you turn it on, Microsoft will prioritize your device to get the latest non-security updates and enhancements when they are available for your device. For managed devices, the toggle is disabled by default. We also have other improvements such as this update will also change firewall settings. You can now configure application group rules. Also, this update addresses an issue that displays task view in the wrong area. This occurs when you close a full screen game by pressing win plus tab. Also, this update addresses an issue that affects Microsoft Edge IE mode. The tab window manager stops responding. And these are basically the highlights of this update. If you want to see the whole list of fixes and improvements, you can check out the article below in the video's description. As always, we also have a Windows 11 service and stack update with the version 20,061.1626, which will ensure that you have a robust or reliable service and stack so that your devices can receive and install Microsoft updates. For the known issues in the this build as well, you can check out the article below in the video's description. So if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.